There's a couple of things that we really think about is number one is we create positions for um, f for things that either agents don't enjoy doing or they're not good at. So um, anything that they're not, you know, don't enjoy doing, they're not good at, mm -hmm. ours not do dollar productive for them. Mm -hmm. um, and so basically we break the real estate transaction into three distinct parts. Okay. So the first part is the marketing part. Mm -hmm. um, that's where a lot of agents fail, you know, when they first get into it. Mm -hmm. um, they may be a great real estate agent working with clients, but they just don't know how to get the leads because there's so many real estate agents that are out there. Um, or they may just not have the um, the dollars to mm -hmm. be able to invest to, to do that. Sure. Sure. And so that's the first part is the marketing part. And realistically, that's why you know a lot of agents join our team initially. Mm -hmm. That's not why they stay. Mm -hmm. You know, they stay for the latter part, the support that we give them, the culture right. that we have. Right. Um, but that's what attracts a lot of agents initially to our team. Um, the middle part is um, what agents are typically used to, kind of being belly to belly to a customer, yep. uh, helping them buy a home, helping mm -hmm. them sell a home. Um, and then the last part is once it goes under contract, taking it from contract to close. Okay. Um, so we have licensed closing coordinators that do that for our team members. Mm -hmm. um, and then we have admin um, spread out throughout the entire process to um, just help make the agents more productive, mm -hmm. make them more efficient. <laughs>